I'm out and about today with the 19 foot 6 inch Sunfinder Caravan. The Sunfinder range is built by Majestic Caravans and Majestic has been knocking it out of the park lately with their builds, so I'm keen to see if the Sunfinder measures up to that standard. Now the Sunfinder is a standardised range of caravans. What you see, more or less, is what you get. So let's get it unhitched and take a look. Now obviously we have a tunnel boot here, but I notice we've also got a gas bayonet down here. And that means, look, later on you might want to fit a slide out tray with a portable barbecue to your near side tunnel boot. Plug it straight into the gas and away you go. Now it's a 19 foot 6 inch caravan on tandem axle, so immediately I thought this van is going to have a really impressive payload capacity. Now looking at the compliance plate, we can see that there's a tear figure of 2,265 kilos and an ATM of 3,200 kilos. And yes, that is an impressive load carrying capacity of 935 kilos for a van such as this, couples van, that is plenty. Now behind this smooth composite aluminium cladding and black checker plate, you'll find a Maranti timber frame and the whole caravan is built on top of an RHS chassis. This particular model is built for semi off-road work, but there is an off-road version available if that's what you would prefer. Well, definitely a nice looking caravan for touring couples. It really does seem to have a good fit and finish and attention to detail throughout. I mean, look at this extra large L-shaped lounge. I mean, that is one of the more spacious dinettes that I have seen in a caravan, especially one that's only 19 foot 6 inch. And you know, some of your features, look, I noticed straight away, you've got your filtered drinking water. So what we'll do is we'll turn the um, water pump on and you'll find the switch for that in the Trek digital display. Um, so we just push the button on that. We can hear the water pump cycling up. And let's see if we get some filtered drinking water through. Yep, here we go. So we can hear the water pump has switched itself off. And that means that the water lines inside the caravan are all pressurized. That's what we want to see. Now over here, we can see we've got the uh, BM Pro Battery Plus 35 battery management system that's linked to the Odyssey Link display, which will send you, you know, crucial information about the van to the Trek display, as well as to an app on your smartphone. Now this caravan comes with a single AGM battery as standard, as well as a 170 watt solar panel. Now remember this caravan, it's a standardized range of caravans. Look, you might be able to make a few minor tweaks here and there, but by and large, what you see is what you get. But this range of caravans at the end of the day is all about just being able to hitch up and head off on holiday without having to add any bits and pieces if you don't want to. This van really is ready to hit the road. Oh, and look, you've also got a sound system. Turn that on. Look, a reasonable amount of storage inside the kitchen. You know, you've got your overhead lockers, of course. Under the sink. One thing I notice is how neatly it's all finished off under there. No massive globs of silicon. The holes cut into the floor look nicely done and nicely gapped. Yeah, I think they've done a good job. There's an ensuite at the back of the caravan. It's not the largest ensuite in the world by any means, um, but that is a bit of a trade-off when you're talking about a 19 foot six inch caravan that has such, you know, a large dinette and a reasonable size kitchen as well. One thing worth pointing out is that this particular model does actually come with a washing machine built into this linen covered storage area. However, this is a customer's van and they specifically requested no washing machine. And that's why instead we have all this extra linen covered storage. The Sunfinder is available in three different sizes. You've got the 18 foot 6 inch model, this 19 foot 6 inch model, and the 21 foot 6 inch model. Now, each one is available in two different layouts. We've got the couples variant, which we can see here, but they're also available with bunks. Some of the standard features on this van include two fresh water tanks, a grey water tank, reverse cycle air conditioner, and let's not forget that Thetford four burner cooktop, griller, and full oven. Now with the Thetford three-way fridge behind me, there's still room underneath for quite a sizable pot drawer. And that's something in this particular van that I quite appreciate. I don't feel that storage is an issue whatsoever. Now I mentioned earlier that the walls of the caravan are smooth composite aluminium cladding. However, the roof is actually a one-piece fiberglass construction going from the front of the caravan all the way to the back. All insulated, of course, as well. Now some of the other features include a couple of nine kilo gas bottles, You've got your 16 inch alloy wheels with all terrain tyres, the spare wheel on the back of the caravan, and what would a caravan be without that full length rollout awning? 
One thing that strikes me about this caravan is the amount of living space, especially in the middle of the van, right about where I am now. That kitchen is quite sizable. And as I mentioned, this dinette is fantastic. There's a lot of space here. I feel like with this particular layout, they really have prioritized living space, and that is always a good thing. Now, I'm sure there is some storage space under this lounge, so I wouldn't mind checking that out. There is a little hatch down here but it appears as though to get to the storage space, uh, we are gonna have to remove some seat cushions. That's not necessarily a bad thing, especially when you have a table that can quite easily move out of the way. This table will actually swivel in any direction that you want for easy access. Now, one thing that I see down here is we've got a couple of 240 volt power points as well as a single USB PowerPoint. And I actually really appreciate that because you might be sitting at the dinette working on a laptop and you don't really want cables running here, there and everywhere. So having them down here will just make things nice and easy. But let's have a look here. It all looks really nicely finished off as well. And yeah, I think you'll get a few bits and pieces in there, why not? But obviously it's not the kind of place that you would store things that you need to use all the time. And it's all neatly finished off. No, you know, raw and exposed ply, nothing that's gonna give you a splinter. And when you're spending tens of thousands of dollars on a van, that's what you would expect. Well, that's the 19 foot six inch Sunfinder Caravan by Majestic. And as we can see, look, this caravan, I reckon really does measure up to that Majestic standard. So I'm all hitched up, no problems at all. It's time to hit the road.